All right, so I've been hard at it, buffing this thing out for the last couple of nights. I've been working on it since the last video I put up of uh, you guys seeing it and some posts I put up, but I finally got it all polished up and I just pulled it out here and was cleaning up most of the compound out of the cracks. So one thing I wanna definitely let you guys know is to get that compound out of those cracks. And this was in the garage, so it never got in the sun, but to any of you guys new to the painting world, when you get that compound stuck in these crevices, it dries up like cement. So I took it out here, rinsed it off, and cleaned all the cracks and got it all cleaned out now so I could start putting everything back together on it. But I haven't showed you guys the finished buffed out sides and the whole car is buffed now. So looks really nice and I'm gonna start assembling it. The first thing I already did was put in the keyhole and I like to go slow when I'm building it back now because you really gotta watch that you don't scratch this because you definitely can't spot this stuff in and you have to be uh, very, very, very careful when you're building these kind of cars like this. So, cause you also have excessive amount of paint than mostly more than a normal paint job does. So you definitely want to take your time now and just go nice and easy. So first thing I'm going to do is pull the wheels, put the wheel well trim and the rockers on it and go ahead and put the wheels back on it. So that way we could see what this thing's going to look like with the wheels on it. So let's go ahead and do that. Just installed the glass and adjusted everything out on it and you guys see how nice and clean it is still so we're gonna put back that nice vapor barrier make sure that that's sealed up because that'll help you with the uh, noise and also uh, you know keep it nice and clean so we went ahead and greased the uh, shaft for the window that way that'll be nice and smooth going up and down and make sure you do that because that'll make it go up and down nice and smooth. So I'll just go up and down a couple times with it, grease it up, and you'll be ready to go. So we got the windows in, all adjusted, the handles are on it, keyholes are in, rockers are on. Wheel wall trims, wheels, and we're gonna keep putting it together, but just wanted to show you the uh, felts are in on the door. Those gotta go in before the windows. Make sure you put those in before the glass. Don't put those, uh, the glass in and then forget because you can't get to the screws. So we're just putting her together and just wanted to show you a little bit more of that as we're doing it little by little, but it's coming along nice.
What's up guys? We finally got it done. All those videos and all that hard work finally paid off. And I'll tell you what, this thing is phenomenal. I'm really happy and privileged to own it. And I love this thing. So check this thing out. Really looks awesome. And look how nice that candy looks. Everything's back together on it. I bought the new emblems. All different stuff I tried to get for it to make it a little bit better than it was. And it just came out phenomenal. I love it. We got the weather strips, the new emblems, and uh, all the stuff that we needed to get it looking right. Jams came out nice and clean. I cleaned up the inside. I still got to do some more to that. You know how that is. You never can get done with any of that stuff, but unbelievable how nice this thing turned out. I'm really ecstatic with it. So appreciate all you guys for supporting me with it and uh, giving me feedback on it. And I'm glad we picked this color for the channel. So this thing looks really, really good and I couldn't have got a better color. So I like what I did with that. Uh, ground coat with that KAD ground coat because you guys know I didn't use the house of colors and I used a water base ground coat on it but look at that thing so we finally got it done it's been a month and I've been working all night on this thing after I get home from work so I'm real tired but really really nice looking job it turned out to be and uh, I'm real happy with it so appreciate it to all you guys that were waiting to see it I've been working hard to get it done for you Believe me, it wasn't easy, but we got it done because, you know, I did this all by myself with no help. So this whole job was done by one person. And when you're doing that, it takes it a little bit longer because you got to do everything slow so you don't screw anything up. But look how nice it looks down the side. Beautiful. So. So I want to thank you guys for uh, sticking in there with me on the build and I hope you guys like this one. There'll be more to come of this kind of stuff. But for now, we're going to be taking a break on doing these big jobs at night and uh, focusing more on some of the stuff during the day. But we aren't done with the custom. But now we can say the candy man finally did a candy paint. So let me know what you guys think of it and uh, we'll see you on the next one.